So the United States of America squad, the team that will be traveling to USA, has finally been announced by Arsenal. And before I even get into that, um, three hours ago, this was reported by Time Spot saying Thomas Pate will be among the players omitted when Arsenal leave for preseason tour to the United States today. Now, for three hours, I I was thinking about doing that video. I kind of said, no, you know what? Let me just wait. But I ended up believing it and recording the video talking about this um, news about Thomas Partey being out of that squad. I am very happy to announce that Thomas Partey will actually be in the USA tour. Now, the problem with social media is that everyone tries to make a name for themselves. So you have to be very careful in terms of what you believe and what you don't believe. And uh, it's great to know that we will not be believing time squad from now on. But I'm definitely happy to announce that Thomas Party will be part of that squad. Be very careful what you believe out there. So here's the official article from Arsenal's website, the one we are definitely going to believe. Um, in terms of which players have traveled, let's see what they have to say. Mikel Arteta's first team squad step up pre-season preparations this week as they embark on a 10-day tour of USA and we have named a 33-man squad for the trip. After our last two proposed visits to America were cancelled due to COVID-19, this is the team's first extended summer tour since 2019 and three warm-up games as well as intensive daily training sessions await the players' state side. Setting off from London on Wednesday, courtesy of Fly Emirates, the players will touch down in Baltimore, Maryland for the first leg of the tour. After 5-1 and 5-3 wins over Ipswich Town and Nuremberg, respectively, um, already this summer, our first game in America will be against Everton at 7 p.m. local time, midnight UK time this Saturday. So very late for everyone in UK, everyone in um, the rest of Europe, everyone in Africa, that will be a very, very late game, just like all the others, to be fair. Um, all the other games. The following day, it's a short flight down the East Coast to Orlando, Florida, where we will face Orlando City next Wednesday, 7.30 p.m. local and 12.30 a.m. UK time before the tour concludes against Chelsea on Saturday, 23rd, July 23rd, 8 p.m. local time, 1 a.m. UK time. Aside from the three games, the players will be continuing their pre-season preparations on the training pitches every day in what, uh, in what are expected to be rigorous sessions while also taking the opportunity to meet local fans at various events um, dotted throughout the week and a half trip. You can watch all three fixtures live on Arsenal.com and our official app, Find Out How, and we'll be bringing you daily updates from inside the camp as well as the countdown to the big Premier League kickoff on August 5th continues. So this is the full score that has been named in terms of um, goalkeepers. Aaron Ramsdale, Bandlane is also part of the tour, Matt Turner, Arthur Okonko and Alex Ranasson. So again, um, Time Sport had actually reported that Bandlane wouldn't be part of the um, tour and that was also a lie. So you have to be very careful in terms of what you believe. Um, defender, so five goalkeepers is crazy. That's a lot of goalkeepers. Defenders, Kieran Tini, Nuno Tavares, Gabriel, Pablo Mari, Ben White, Rob Holding, William Saliba, Hector Bellerin, Cedric Suarez, Takehiro Tomiyasu, and Walters will be part of the defenders. So those are around um, 11 defenders. Midfielders, Mohamed El Neni, Lucas Torewa, Thomas Pate, Emil Smithrow, Albert Sambi Lokonga, Granite Xhaka, Martin Odegaard, Niles, Fabio Vieira, very, very good to see him, and Dries Nelson. And in terms of forwards, Gabriel Martinelli, Edin Ketia, Gabriel Jesus, Nicolas Pepe, Bukayo Saka, Fallerin Balagan, and Makinya. So the players that are returning, Ramdale is returning, um, the likes of Saka returning, Odegaard, uh, Odegaard Granite Xhaka, all of them are returning. Pepe is part of the squad. Um, he seems to be he will like he will be here until maybe later on in the transfer window. He might end up staying. You never know. I still 60% of me thinks he's going to stay. 40% is going to leave, but you have to wait and see. Lucas Torre is also part of the squad, surprisingly. But I've just had news that Valencia have kind of agreed, have a pre-agreement with Arsenal for um for Torreira, so that could also happen very, very soon after this tour. Hector Bellerin, another one I'm expecting to live alongside Maitland Niles, but at the moment they're all part of the tour. We will finally get to see Fabio Vera playing some minutes. Those are three interesting games. Uh, can't wait to see all these players playing. 33 players part of that tour. So I don't think there's anyone missing. That is everyone. There was talks about Thomas Partey missing out, talks about um, Balagan missing out, and talks about um Leno missing out but they're all part of the tour so I think it's fine enough we, uh, we should be waiting for Arsenal to announce most of this news because uh, most of the outlets out there just try to make a name for themselves that is the problem with social media these days and for a long time so that is Arsenal's squad to USA 
Um, those are the three games, Orlando City, Everton, and also um, Chelsea. They will be at crazy times for you guys watching from Europe and Africa. If you're watching from Australia or USA or South America, I, I think the times will be great for you, morning and afternoon. But for the guys in Africa, Europe, and Asia, times will be crazy. But hey, cannot wait to see Arsenal in action once again. Thank you for watching and catch up with you guys on the next one.